Hello guys, so Jerry speaking, welcome to LJPCB as episode 1337. Today we react to um, Spirit from Alien Season 3 Episode 6 featuring Charles Dad and oh my god, this is going to be a holy crap type of episode of LJP Um, uh, for Spirit from Alien. And we have to just begin in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go. One spin of the wheel can win one million dollars. From Studio 25 in Campbell, California, this is Spin for a Million. Wow. And now, here's the star of Spin for a Million, Robert Fillmore. Wow. It makes more sense to me, you know, just any freaking, uh, let's say, something, um, rapper short space and rapper anything like that, you know. It makes total sense to anybody, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Continue on. Thank you all so much. Wow, what a crowd. Thank you, Brandon Spruz, and welcome everyone to Spin 4 a Million, where a spin could make you a millionaire. So far this season, we've gave away a lot of money to lucky people from all over the nation. Like me! I was good. I was one of those people, y'all. Continue on. We crowned a million dollar winner two episodes ago. And yeah, that makes more sense. You know, but this episode's gonna be more cringy as it was. Yeah. We hope we can't do it today, but right. Yeah, that made more sense. Yeah. Now let's bring out our three contestants of the night as we get to play lucky number. Good, good, and I hope this is not gonna be as looks as be cringy as enough. You know, that's just me. T one. And here our contestants, Dave, Tyler. And Devious Diesel are all here to guess a number between 1 to 36. I guess it's gonna get even more cringy as it looks. Don't shake. Okay, this is getting more cringy. Okay. Okay. Anyway. Each of you will make a guess from 1 to 36. Then we will start the jumbler to determine the number. The two who are closest to the number high or low will get a dollar sign. And bonus points based upon your guess. The first two to get three dollar sign will move on to 0 to 100. And we will multiply those points by 50 and convert them into dollars. Yeah! Yeah! What's the happens, Robert? Continue on. The other will walk away with $1,000. Each of you will receive $1,000 just for being here. Ooh. What are any looks like now? So without further ado, lock in your guesses from one to thirty. Well, that's I know. Huh? Anyway. He's six. Twenty-five. Thirty-six. All of our guess. Okay. All of our guesses have been locked in. Nobody can make any changes. Let's start the jumbler. Twelve. So the points and dollar sign will go to Dave and Tyler. Wow. All right, everyone. It's now time for your next round of guesses. Lock and win done. And now let's start up the jumbler for a few seconds and see what number we get now. 
22. So once again, Dave and Tyler get the points and dollar sign. What? This game is rigged. I literally have no points. Seriously? This is never gonna shut up! And these two buffoons are just ruining it all for me. Damn it, dude! These, do these are called dollar signs, idiot! Okay, Devious Diesel, I would appreciate if you kept your comments to yourself next time. Uh, exactly, exactly. Because we are all playing a fair game here. Uh. But anyways, both Dave and Tyler each have two dollar signs, and if they are successful with this next one, they both will move on to the elimination round. We have our guesses locked in, and start the jumbler once again. Fifteen. That means Dave and Tyler will be moving on to play zero to one hundred. No, this is... Anyway, let's get to you on. I I always know what to do. Not happening. I demand that the metro please do this. You know what? I'm done with these fools. I'm just gonna walk away and write a bad review on this show. Well that was unexpected. So when we multiply the points by fifty, then add the one thousand dollars. Dave has a total of four thousand dollars, and Tyler has three thousand six hundred fifty dollars. And now it's time for our elimination game, where you have to get close to 100 without going over in 0 to 100. Yeah! Yeah, do something about it, you know? I just don't know what to do with this challenge that behavior. Congratulations, Dave and Tyler, for making it up to the second round. Now it's time to determine who will move on to spin for a million and who will walk away with their winnings. The object of the game is to get close to 100 without going over. Our number jumbler is generating numbers 0 to 50, and each of you will have two opening spins. At the end of the game, whoever is the closest to 100 will have their points multiplied by 100 and will move on to spin the wheel. Getting 100 on the nose will reward you $10,000 and will play a special mini game for some extra money. So with that being said, we will start off with Dave's two opening spins, and when you are ready, hit the button to stop it. Hope you want. That's a great start there, Dave. Now let's go for your second opening spin. 16. Taking you up to 57. Now it's time for Tyler's opening spins. 28. Not too bad. Not too bad. Now let's go for your next spin. Four. Taking you up to 32. Now we are going to go to the person with the higher score, and that would be Dave with 57. If you wish, you can stop at 57 to see if Tyler can beat you or go over, or you can risk your points and try for a higher score. I'm gonna go for it. I feel good about getting a higher score. He's gonna go on. All right, Dave. Anything higher than 43, you go over 100, and Tyler will win the game. Two, you're still alive. You now have 59. We now go Tyler with his spin, and he is in good shape. Mm -hmm. 37, taking you <laughs> God help to me. 69, and you now have the lead. We now go to you, Tyler, since you are the new leader. Do you wish to continue on, or stay with 69? I would like to risk my points and go on, please. All right, anything more than 31, you go over and Dave wins the game. Let's see what happens. 44, mm, wow. and you have gone over and Dave wins. Yeah, it does make sense. Here we go. Here we go, here we go. It's the game with $5,900. I won. Yay. I wonder if I could just spin the wheel for a million. Congratulations, Dave. You are moving on to spin the wheel for a million dollars. And Tyler, spend your winnings wisely. Thank you for playing the game.
It was a pleasure being a contestant on this show. You're welcome. And with your $4,000 you won earlier, you have a total of $9,900. And that is yours no matter what happens in a spin for a million round. Oh. And that is where we will be heading to right after we take time out for this break as Dave Johnson from Morgan Hill, California could spin his way to a million dollars. Yeah, here goes nothing. Yeah. Not that you yeah, that kind of bullshit, yeah. I don't want to do next, but you know, that's just me. Yeah, I'm gonna be saying that. If you'd like to spin for a minute, send us a request on the 25 official Facebook page or comment down below this video and join the 25 Discord server. You must be at least 18 years or older to play. Wow. Thank you, Brandon and what Welcome back to the show. I am here with Dave Johnson, who has won $9,900, and now he's about to spin and hopefully win a million dollars. Congratulations, Dave, for making it up this far. Thank you. I can't believe this is really happening. Oh, shut up. So why don't you tell us a little bit about yours? Elf Dave, okay, my name is David Johnson, and I love Barney the Dinosaur. He's my lord and savior, and I love to play with toys. Well, that's pretty interesting to say the least. Anyways, what would you do with your winnings? Buy everything that is Barney related. Please help me to God. Yay. Well, that's nice, Dave. All right, Dave. When you are ready, give the wheel a go. Oh, man. Before we begin this whole zero, let's say, wins a million, let's say zero dollars to a million, from wins, let's say, that and win a million dollars, it makes sense. You, you have to just suffer that nine hundred thousand nine hundred nine dollars But, you know, let's pause for it. I'll be right back. But, folks, um, this has, has never happened before, but let's just continue on. Fair enough, Kevin. You almost have a 95. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Zero. What? No. No. What? It's not bad! Try to figure it out yourself, Charles Dad Jesus! Or I lost the game and got nothing. It's just a game! I wanted more money. What? Oh man, Dave, I am so sorry this had to happen. But I was really hoping that I could win a lot more money. But I lost. Don't feel lucky, Hugh. There's no need to cry, Dave. You are still walking out of here with $9,900. Thank you. Thank you. I want to spin again. I want to spin again. Hell no! I want to spin again. What? Come on, Dave. We are not doing this again. You know what? I'm running away. What? He will never oh. grow up. Thank you! I'm just glad that's done and over with. Anyways, folks, that is all the time we have here on Spin for a Million. Join us the following week for the season three finale of Spin for a Million. This is Robert Fimlower saying thanks for spinning for a million. Good night, everyone. Wow. Yeah. Your announcer Brandon Strug speaking for Spin or Amelia, a Paris production group presentation.
that was Spin for a Million, Season 3, Episode 6. I think it was cringy enough to say it, but it was... Ugh. Yeah. The child with dad behavior issues. Why bother? There was another review that's episode 1,347. Hope you enjoy it. Stay tuned. Next one's going to be... I'm not sure what the next episode might be. You just have to wait and find out for yourselves. The next episode I'm doing, next video I'm doing, will be a Truth to Cross Special Part 36 YouTube Edition. I'm not, I'm not going to do a, let's say, live stream based off of um, the YouTube Edition uh, basics. Let's just see what happens. Um, Till next time. So, Jones, Bob, so, baby, good boys, we ask you so, so, say, out. See ya. Giving on to me this life I'll never take for granted. And given all the time I failed to really understand it I never sought to meet the maker of reality The one who gave the life that which is always happening But I tried All the time Was I the one to see things as I do on